to it, then they'll start to pass a wee bit and take a few more risks and either mistakes or brilliant play could lead to a few chances, hopefully. Wales again, look down the left-hand side. Harms trying to get on the end of it. Gets it this time. Wales certainly putting more pressure down there. Ellie King side to go back, switch the angles. Hesketh, back to King. That's better from Wales now. Interlinking, getting the ball. Ewing does really well there. Great Lays run. off to Beck. And now here's Denham on the right. Good football from Wales, this is. This is a really good move. And he's got a chance of a shot. And the keeper's tipped it over the bar. And there's applause around for a very good Wales move. That was wonderful football. Brilliant, great build-up right from the back, went from one side to the other. Patient build-up as well. He started again, the big number five and the overlap. Started again in, and then he was able to drive in, pick his moment and have a goal, which is a great play and a good save in the end by the goalkeeper. First major move of note, just as we'd said that there wasn't anything. Baldy wins the free header there and gets an, another free header. A little appeal for a handball, but the ball went out anyway. I think Baldy did brilliant initially. He was very well positioned and headed it. But I think his, his follow-up header then screamed of an attacker back defending. I think it wasn't. Uh, it didn't really clear the lines efficiently. But listen, he, he did the job and he was back there helping out the team. Narrow then, Holly. He's coming inside, so narrow up. Narrow up. Well, a good save there from Callum Taylor in goal for Northern Ireland. So that will give him a little bit of a boost as well. Good. Wales again going down the left hand side. King Helms starting to go all the way back to the goalkeeper. That's quite a dangerous ball from the halfway line. Good. Hesketh. Good for the keeper conference. Good play again. Building the way out from the back. Nice and patient. You can see the interchange and the movement between the middle three of, uh, of the Welsh team. And now you're starting to see the number six for Wales dropping off the game. Hesketh is really dropping off, and you can see he's a footballer uh, very much in a similar style of football that they try and play at senior level. It's, it's coming down to the levels again where they've got tidy little midfielders getting on it and not, not afraid to drop off and get it. Yeah, she really started to see the Welsh team uh, pass the ball about with real intent here. It's almost as if that previous move has given them a little bit of confidence to to say, yes, you know, you can do this. And they're finding a few holes here and there. There again, you're see, seeing the likes of a Heskett. So as I mentioned, you, you're looking, you're just waiting for a centre midfielder or one of the, one of the uber-talented boys. You're seeing Heskett in particular drop off and take responsibility. He's only slight in his build, but he's obviously a brave footballer with technical ability. He's dropping off and getting it and starting to play. Northern Ireland will push a few men up there and Comfrey tries to play the longer ball but in the end gives away possession so Northern Ireland have possession now here's Devaney on the overlap again swings across in Baldy looking to get on the end of it and a half chance there that ball could have easily have fallen to a Northern Ireland foot and again you're seeing that's the out ball the wing backs are essential in this system Devenny is the one that's having more joy on this side, but again, straight away, the boys look for it, and he's on his bike, he's up the line, and he's got a good ball into the box, and it's only a whisk away from hitting ball in the head, so um, it's one of these ones, if they can keep doing that, it, it won't matter about the little bit of possession in front of the back four of Wales, it's all about chances and goals, as we saw earlier with the Republic against, uh, against Scotland. 